Dude, you started this without, like... Oh, shoot. I got sick. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> welcome to Kirby's Dreamland. Um, we got We literally got so caught up. What do you mean, we? I got so caught up playing the game. <laughs> Uh, now we're in the amusement park dream. Uh, oh yeah, that's what these things are, is like dreams of the er different areas, by the way. Uh, I think. I don't I don't re really remember how they described them. I, th I, I, do, I think they literally just said that they're like the dreams of the different uh, areas throughout the Forgotten Land. I didn't know planets could dream. They're Leongar's dream. Ew. <laughs> uh, wee. Uh... <laughs> Hey, that's our God, first little piece of the being a little menace to the dogs. Yeah, he... Our, our smallest dog, Peanut, uh, which, by the way, I told my coworkers that I have a dog named Peanut, and they thought it was hilarious. Why? Because Peanut's such, like, a, a ridiculous... Oh, wait, no, I still need this. Dang it. Uh, Peanut's, like, a ridiculous name for a dog, which I'll... It, 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 I, it was even funnier, because... it was, they Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. I'm sorry. It's fine, I got him. Uh, cause like when I told him I have another dog named Dot, they were just like, you are the master of naming animals. Did you tell him that you didn't name those dogs? I did. You did name them? I named P Dot and Peanut. Oh. Yeah. Give me credit where credit's due. No. <laughs> There's nothing to be proud of. Um, okay. Now I gotta get over there. Oh, the snapper. I have to admit, I like that it- I Holy think shit, he Yeah, he can go upwards. I didn't know that. I think it's also a really cool detail in this game that like, the further away something is, the lower its frames are. I don't know if that's intentional or not, but it looks kind of neat. I think it's a it's a, a common thing for like Switch games. You're probably right. Because like Cause Breath of the Wild, I think does that too. I thought Breath of the Wild did it as a thing of like the further away something is, it becomes like a background at some point. I don't know. I know that like people don't appear until they good job until they get like a certain distance to you. And isn't it the, it's like the towers are made up of like less polygons and stuff when they're further away, right? Shit, I don't know. It's been a minute since I've actually played that game. You were playing it right before we started. Yeah, but I was in the tutorial. And? There's the no tutorial. buildings. There's really no buildings on the plateau. But it has polygons. Damn. Fuck, man. I can't fight that logic. I also love the, uh, I love that people constantly talk about how 2B... Uh, from Nair Automa. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever the game is. Isn't it a thing of, like, her ass has more polygons than, like, any video game asset ever? Yeah. Which, like... Good job, game developers, I guess. Listen, they knew what people were going to be paying attention to when they played that game. That's true. Yeah, you can play the game. Uh, it was okay. It was fine, but, like... The sound design was really good. It was. But, like, I couldn't fully enjoy it, probably because it's, like, game eight of a whole series. <laughs> yeah, and also, you don't really play combat games. <coughs> Nuh-uh. <laughs> I do play combat games sometimes, if they interest me. Yeah, but they're, like, not one of the games that you play the most. Anyway. Dude! Sorry, I'm trying to, like, remember all my attacks. No, not you! <laughs> ah, shit! Oh, fuck, I'm doing it wrong. Fuck! <laughs> Kirby enemies have, like, a real interesting okay, way don't, of attacking. Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. There we go. I wasn't even near uh, him. Well, I had to make sure. Dude, if you find food, can you, like, kiss me or something? Um. If you find some Chipotle, just bur baby bird it to me. <laughs> 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 oh, man. Dude, Nintendo is, like, such cowards for taking out the kissing ability. What do you mean? I told it, like, because in this game, you just high-five. Yeah. Like, come here, I just got food. Okay, well, that was a bad angle, but... Well, I mean, like, if people have watched any of the other videos or just anyone else play this game, they would know it's a high-five. Yeah, you just walk up and you're like, yay. Actually, if they're watching other people play this game, they're probably not playing it two-player. That's fair. But, yeah, it's just, like, it's a, it's a high-five, but then in the original game... Wait, was it a kiss before? In the original game? Like, not in the... I don't mean, like, in the base game. I fell! <laughs> You were going to fall, too. Uh, but, like, I don't mean, like, in the Baseland Kirby and the Forgotten Land. I mean, like, in the original Kirby games. Like, I think I have one for the DS. Um, and in those games, uh, if you have a companion, you just kiss him. Damn, man. Right on the mouth? Yeah. Tongue? Probably. Kirby's a freak. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is, uh, uh, uh. What? I don't know. I thought there was something up here. Uh, I think we can... 
go get that food. Go get it, girl. No. Go get your food. No. Do it. Get back here. <laughs> <laughs> you trying to stab me? No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, cool. That's all the um, souls okay, in this let's, area. Okay, let's get out. <laughs> let's deedle. Oh, cool. I get to do this. <laughs> yes. That's a bright idea. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna guy. <laughs> You're gonna guy? I'm gonna guy. I'm just gonna guy all over the place. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> ah, shit! <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that happens. Okay, man. You can't blame me for forgetting. Yes, I can. You're the one who played this level. I'm sorry. I'm not the video game boy. I don't no, win. Shit, oh, shit, shit, shit. Ah, fuck. Haha, <laughs> you got hit. You're dumb. They're great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Good job. We are just the masters of comedy. I, I think I would go so far as to say we are the Jesus Christ of jokes. Good job. <laughs> oh, fuck. I remembered that one. Well... And I definitely didn't just do that bomb accident. Oof. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. How, this is taking, how are you? <laughs> this is taking all of my willpower to not fall <laughs> like an idiot. I already fell. Good job. Thank you. Yeah, it's taking all my willpower not to like fall like an idiot. Can't you like just hold it? I can, but I walk slower. Yes, please. Just hold it. <laughs> Listen, man. Get good scrub. Give me a chance to see. <laughs> <laughs> am I right, gamer bros, or am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Just an old windy part. <laughs> Again, I'll draw him away. You get it. Good job. Now I'm trapped. This is all part of the plan. To steal mm. Christmas? Yes. I'm going to... Fuck. <laughs> 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 I'm actually very glad that happened because it means I didn't get to finish my joke. Watch out. Nerd. Thanks for warning <laughs> me, you asshole. I did warn you. Yeah, as I was getting stabbed. <laughs> Not my fault. Yes, it is. It's 100% your fault. <laughs> I love you. But I am very glad that that happened because it means I didn't get to finish my joke. What was wrong with your joke? I don't want to see. Can you, can you whisper it to me? I can whisper sweet nothings. Come here. Come here, I should, I should whisper. That's not bad. We've made jokes worse than that. <laughs> we have, but it, it's embarrassing because Krimis. Krimis? Krimis. Krimis? Krimis. 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 Dude. I love you. I love you too. Get, hurry up and get your- Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what were you saying? Uh, I don't know. I got hit, so I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I blanked out. <laughs> okay. Let's... Um. Uh, oh, no. D did we get it all the souls in this area? We didn't. Um, fuck. Oh. But, oh, well. Uh, you almost reached for the dreamland, so I, I you did. don't want that. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Come on. Hang on, I was taking a sip of some tea. No, you're not. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Kirby's not drinking tea. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, man. Shit. Oh, I went too far. Ha 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 ha, nerd. I am a nerd, thank you for noticing. Oh, shit, we gotta get across. Okay. Wait, can't ice skate over mud? Yeah, ice can just skate over mud. Great. Can't you also just, like, breathe? <laughs> <laughs> I can't, actually. And I thank you to remember that. It's a quippling medical condition. <laughs> <laughs> quippling? Yeah. <laughs> I will thank you to recall I cannot breathe. I don't possess lungs. Ow! Ha <laughs> nerd. Why didn't you tell me it was going to do that? Because I didn't know it was going to do that. I feel like you did. You just want me to suffer. <laughs> I'm just an asshole. <laughs> what can I say, man? It's not my fault. You just need to get good scrub. Dude, what's wrong with that guy? He's a nightmare. Remember? I, think he, I think he just has depression. <laughs> <laughs> he just needs to go to therapy, dude. Yeah, man. Just see a therapist. You'll feel better. Just don't be sad. It's that easy. Just stop. <laughs> Get some help. It's like a list. All you gotta do is just stop. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, there's a thing over here, too. Oh, god, shit. <laughs> I was just over there. 
Oh, uh, well, I guess I'm going down. Oh, okay, Oh, thank shit, you. I'm also going down. Your power. Thank you. Also, I need to grab that rare stone. <laughs> also, yep. I want donuts. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, all the donut places are closed. Oh, uh, it says you. It's called breaking and entering. <laughs> I could also make donuts if I wanted to. Then why don't you? Because... Why also haven't you made me cake or cookies like you said you were? For okay, like I said that I was gonna make you cake, and then you immediately like I, I said we were gonna I was gonna make you cake as soon as I was done doing what I was doing, and as soon as I was done, you were like, okay, let's record. I told you yesterday that at three we were gonna record. Okay, and I told you right as we were doing the thing we were doing. Hey, when we're done, I'm gonna make you a cake, and then as soon as we were done, you're like, okay, we're recording now. <laughs> So it isn't my fault. That's because we gotta keep on a schedule. We're double recording today. Oh my god, we are. I wanna take a nap. Okay, I'll take a nap with you. No, I'm not. Just get into a cuddle puddle. I'm not gonna take a nap, but I will cuddle. In your puddle. <laughs> oh shit, no! Ah, fuck. Oh crap, can we not get out? <laughs> ah crap, we can't get out. Why? What's wrong? We can't get that one soul piece. Like we Oh, just... I didn't see it. Yeah, we can't get. Oh wait, 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 hang on, let me try. <laughs> <laughs> oh uh, well. There's no polygons there. They 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 stole our <laughs> they stole our advantage. They stole my ass. Damn it. Damn it. No. <laughs> Not my cheeks. Oh, okay. Now so. I can't jiggle, jiggle. I just fold. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what this is is we gotta just go around. Um, and we gotta go through. We basically have to go through this maze. Hang on, I need bomber man to do this thing. It's too bad you can't become my things. What happened to Bomberman Senior? Um, he's actually an enemy in some of the games. I don't think he's in these games. Dude, you're running off without me. I know. Stop. <laughs> oh shoot, I hate this. Okay, you stand next to that switch, because these are timed. There we go. Yeah, I don't feel like doing the puzzle, so. Good job. Um. God damn it! Uh. Oh fuck me, dude! <laughs> I think I'm stuck. I think I, think I got myself stuck. No, don't get me stuck with you. I I don't have a choice. I think I think I, I think I actually just got myself stuck. Oh, got it. Okay, cool. Um. Oh, shit. I don't no, want to be way. stuck in the middle with you. I don't want to be around you. You're weird. You smell gross. Ow. I'm gonna fucking die. I'm also going to die. <laughs> really? Cool. I'm I'm literally forgetting to commentate. Hang on. Yeah. I got it. I did it. I, I, cool. I'm I smart. Praise I'm better, me. I'm better than you. Dweeb. Watch out. No. Dweeb. Oh, hey, crash. Yay. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Good job. Coolio. Coolio McSchoolio, dude. Welcome to McSkeezies. <laughs> What's up? Still trying to remember the other word that goes in front of McSpankies. <laughs> <laughs> Big McThankies for coming to McSpankies? No, it's not it. Are you sure? McThankies sounds right. No. Now let's fight the one with jiggle physics. Oh no, you're her hot sister. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I like that when she <laughs> appears, they like it for a for like a fraction of a frame. It's just her ass. I like, tried to capture her ass when, the first time we played. Like just for for a fraction of a frame, it's just those cheeks. Like oh fuck, can't get me from up here, stupid. Ow. Fuck. I think she can. She's cheating. She's jumping around like a queen. <laughs> Guess who else is also jumping around like a bee? <laughs> That's different. We're the good guys. We're not dweebs when we're fighting for good. <laughs> Something. I think the word that I'm looking for is. I don't know. It's a, it's a name. What? It's a because it's like um, McSpanky's is his last name. Hmm. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. Oh. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. I'm gonna look it up once we're done. <laughs> you have been on this for days. I have. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, they, they made... A... What the fuck? Oh yeah, we got a... One of them is real and the other is not. So we just gotta, like, wait it out. 
Found her. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> no, then. Okay. Uh -huh. Owie. Stop. <laughs> Just oh, fight fuck. For, Just fight for good. Why can't you? Because she's an illusion. Oh no, I'm gonna die. It's okay. I'll survive. So I'll live to tell your tale. <laughs> if I choose to. <laughs> no, man, don't you know? Dead men tell no tales. That movie was bad. <laughs> we, like, watched it a little while ago, and it's not good. Like, my favorite scene is just when he tosses the dead sharks into the... You have no health. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it was like when he tosses the zombie sharks in the water, and we just made the joke that he does it to, like, attract actual sharks. <laughs> to attract living sharks to use for his plan. Yeah. <laughs> he just tosses some dead... Sh it's like chumming the water. He just tosses them in there. He's like, go get him. <laughs> oh my god, but that whole movie was so stupid because they had this whole message about how like women can do the jobs that men can, but they had fucking Elizabeth become the Pirate King. Mm -hmm. Or whatever it fucking is. It's called Pirate King. Yeah, they, she's the Pirate King. How is that not... How is, how is that not inspirational? And the stupid astrology woman is... <laughs> Whatever her fucking deal was, she was a witch or some shit. I don't that, know. that was also like a really like her whole character is stupid. All of the shit her character goes through is pointless. Yes, it is. <laughs> like My there's no god that movie was stupid. Like there was no reason for her character to really go through any of the things that she went through. Like being accused of, of being a witch, like that makes no. Do you want to go back to town real fast and heal? Sure. Like, the whole, like, she goes, um, what was it? She's, like, being accused of being a witch because she's into fucking astrology or some shit. Yeah, and then they have, like, like a guy who's also, uh, into astrology. And then, like, when she does it, it's like, witch! She's a witch! <laughs> and, like, it's just, it's really stupid when they do it. Because it's, it's pointless. It's all pointless. It makes no sense. There's no point to it. What's the point? What's the point? <laughs> Why are we here? Just to suffer. She is. Yeah? <laughs> Eat it here real fast. Um, but yeah, like, the, 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 the her, her character has just no point towards existing, period. There's, like, so much wrong with that movie, because they, like, do a soft retcon, but also they change things that has already been established. Yeah, and, like, most of the characters were just, like, completely pointless. They got rid of fucking Calypso. Yeah, and they tried to, like... Well, they try to retcon her or some shit, and they try to retcon the compass. I wonder why, though. Because Calypso was fucking cool. Because I think they, they were going to try and, like, take Jack Sparrow out of the, um, out of the movies. Oh. Because this is when the Amber Heard stuff happened. Was it? Yeah. I think so. It was around that time. When, like... I'm gonna look that up, like when the movie came out. Uh, do you want to do it between episodes, or do you want to pause the episode real fast? No, we're like halfway through. So, uh, you know, yeah, I'll, I'll look. I'll look it up between episodes. I'll look it up later. Okay. Uh, but like either way, it was like, it was just really dumb. There's just so many moments throughout that movie that I thought like didn't need to happen. Hang on. There was something where it's like it could have. I I think when I was watching it, you were making this big deal about like um. Barbosa shouldn't know about the uh, about the Poseidon thing because the trident. Th yeah, because nobody's ever like come back from it or something, or nobody's ever been to the realm or something. You made a point that he shouldn't know what he's talking about. Uh, no, no, no. I made the point that like the uh, the British shouldn't have any reason to want the trident because they say that like the British. Like, they go to Barbosa's witch, which I don't know why Barbosa has a witch. Because <laughs> he's but... fucking cool. He's got his own personal witch. <laughs> but they, like, there's no, they, they, like, they, so, so one, they want to execute, uh, whatever. I don't even remember what her name was. The astrology girl. I'm just going to call her astrology girl. They wanted to execute astrology girl. Daughter of Barbosa. Yeah, which also was, like, a really pointless plot thing that didn't need to exist for any purpose. Oh, ice cream. Oh, good for you. Kiss me. Kiss me, you fool. With our hands instead of our lips. Hashtag no coronavirus. But, um... 
they may they they make it a point of like they want to execute astrology girl because she's a witch for doing astrology, and then they go to like just an actual straight up witch. That they just like just a legit witch who they just find, I guess. And apparently they're okay with her existing because they she's Barbosa's witch, and Barbosa in this movie is like. Uh, he doesn't work for the crown. He doesn't. No, at the end of the movie with Blackbeard, he like defects and he's like, "I'm back to being a pirate. Fuck you guys. We." Um, <laughs> Fuck you guys. We. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much what he does. He literally is just like, "I'm a pirate again. We. Bye. I have. I have Blackbeard ship, so I don't want the pearl, but I also still want the pearl for some reason." Um, the pearl's cool. <laughs> the, the pearl is cool, I guess. Um, you want to sacrifice yourself for that, please? Thank you. Where's crystal gem? <laughs> <laughs> but like, so. Oh wait, I gotta heal it. Come here. So like they, uh, so Barbosa is a pirate again, but they, I don't, one, how do they like find Barbosa's, uh, witch? I guess, I guess she was just around for people to find. Hang on, I've only got three shots with this, so I gotta go. What? How do you only have three shots? Because it's, it's for, it's for, it's, it's a puzzle. It's meant to make you be smart. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Is it raining? Yeah, it's been raining off and on all day. That's why I wasn't able to do any gardening. Raining really hard now. It is. Uh, it was light. It was just like light sprinkles earlier, but now it's just letting. It's just letting loose. For a while, I was wondering if we needed to go like water the plants because it wasn't raining uh, enough. But I think it's fine now. Yeah, we're good. Um, ah, ow! What happened? Um, eyelash. Oh, uh, okay. Oh man, that sucks. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. You good? Um, so like the the British find the witch, and the British are I guess so I guess they like they're okay with they're the witch. Because they don't, they don't threaten to, like, they don't threaten to execute the witch or anything like that. They're just like, hey, you work for us now. You, uh, tell us how to read this astrology. Because for some reason, none of the fucking naval captains can, like, do basic astrology. Even though that's something that most naval captains are taught, like, back then. Because that was, like, the, one of the e easiest ways to navigate. But sure, whatever. We need a fucking witch for it, I guess. Even though it's clearly just fucking plain astrology. But, uh, Hang on, I need, I think, ah, oh, fuck. I need that guy's. Oh. I'm sorry. No, that I killed him, so that was on me. But like, it was. It's just so. It's so fucking stupid. But, but like, there was a whole point where, like, when they got to the realm where the uh, uh, trident was, you said that there there was something that someone shouldn't have known, because there was like a whole deal of like, uh, no one knows about it. Oh, um. Oh shit! I know what you're talking about. Because it's like we made the uh, like we said that. A thing the movie could have done that would have been cool is that the person who was guiding them was actually the, uh, was actually Poseidon himself, and that's why he knows about the trident. Oh, right. The thing that they say is that, like, they, they say that, like, the trident can break any curse, uh, and, like, in order to break the curse, you have to break the trident, which I just thought was really dumb, because it's like, how does that, that doesn't make any sense. Also, how do you know that? Yeah, like no one. How do you know? How do you know that? How do you know that if the trident's never been broken before? Yeah, exactly. And they're like, well, how do you know that the trident can break any? You need I a new. Can... You need a different power. It's ice. No, I can use the hammer to break it. I just I need to be able to charge it up. God, it's raining fucking hard. It is. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, you know <laughs> I know what to do. Shut up. Stop. I know what I'm doing wrong. Hang on. I gotta like. Dude, you're gonna die. Don't. Oh, you are dead. Well, I, there's no fire ability in here. I have to use the hammer ability because I used it on the other block of ice. I just need to be able to like charge up. Ah, shit. But anyway, so yeah, I think it was uh the son of Turner or something. Will son. Yeah. Whose name was Hen? What was his name? Henry. I don't know. I don't remember anyone from that movie. I'm pretty sure it was Henry. But like, um, we were we were saying that like, what if um, that guy wasn't actually the son of uh, Will? It was uh, Poseidon, or Poseidon was like reincarnated as uh, Will's son, and that would have been like a better twist to the movie that would have explained how he knows all this shit. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you just melted it with your fire. I told you that's how it works. Well, I thought you were just good. Never mind. Did I miss a nail? Oh, I have to go back and get all the nails that I already got. Okay. But yeah, there was just so many moments throughout that movie that were just, like, so point... Like, uh, so the pirate... 
Hunter. What was his name? Salazar? Yeah, Salazar. Salazar had, like, the worst fucking villain intro ever. Because, like, he's supposed to be, like, this... Oh, he's this cool, like, uh, ghost uh, pirate hunter guy who's, like, a zombie. And he's, like, using two swords as canes because he can't fucking walk. I'm intimidating, but I'm going to hobble my ass after you. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then, like, they he shows up and uh, one of the fucking... Okay, we got all the soul pieces. Okay, good. We can just leave. Yeah, and then one of the fucking uh, shit people, who also, they weren't pirates. I don't know why he wanted to kill them. I think he just... I think that was actually don't just kill a... I think that was actually just a murder scene. <laughs> I think so. I think he just wanted to kill those dudes to prove a point. I want this. Because, like, he, sh he just fucking... He doesn't have any reason for killing them. He just kind of does it. And then he shows up, and they, uh, they're like, oh, uh, who, what are you? And he's just... The way he says it, he goes... Death. Like, it's, <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Death. He's like, he sounds like he's like, ha he sounds like he's like. He's not actually saying what his name is. He just is praying for death. <laughs> he's just like, he just really wants to die. He's like not okay. And like, it's so fucking goofy. Then he just like, he sounds like he's sick. The only good thing that I will say came out of that movie is that someone, like, Jack Tokyo drifted a boat. <laughs> yeah, which, like, how, that's just awesome. Like, that's bragging rights for life. How the fuck do you Tokyo drift a boat? <laughs> <laughs> how do you set a TV on fire underwater? And, like, the thing is, uh, we made a joke about, like, um, when he first, like, when the pirate hunter guy met Jack... He shouldn't have known that that was, um, Jack the Sparrow. Oh, yeah, because they also retcon that. Like, Jack's name isn't Jack Sparrow anymore. His title is Jack the Sparrow. And then people just call him Jack Sparrow. Like, that, that's so, that's fucking stupid. But it's like, we made the joke of, like, he didn't know, at first he didn't know it was him until he Tokyo drifted a boat. And then he was like, <laughs> this might be him. <laughs> he, like, sees Jack Tokyo drift another boat. And he's like, that's so familiar. <laughs> I've only seen one man Tokyo drift a boat. <laughs> I've only known one man to be so powerful as to Tokyo drift a whole ass boat. <laughs> Fuck. Stop jumping in the water. I, I'm, I try. I, I don't think I can get back up. I think I'm done. I think I'm. Oh wait. <laughs> Shut up. Shut your mouth. No. Shut your mouth before I human centipede you. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Shut your mouth before I sew it to someone's God ass. Damn, you almost jumped back into that water. <laughs> you almost were cute. Uh, my eyes burn because I'm laughing at you. <laughs> Shut up, I died. Yes, I know. <laughs> Stop trying to do that. <laughs> well, it's because I think I need to bring the cone over there to get a, a, another soul piece or something. Okay, well, if you... Yeah, fuck it. No if, soul... Oh, wait, I'm here. If that's your explanation, then why did you Shit. go... Why did you go head first into the water? Shut up. Just straight up diving into that water. <laughs> uh... Oh, yeah, but, like, another stupid, really, like, just really stupid thing is, like, when Salazar, like, introduces himself and he says his name, he says it twice. Death! Death! <laughs> no, that's when he... Oh, can you get that, actually? Since you... I, I can't see. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, he shows up and, like, um, Will's son, Henry... I think it's Henry. I'm just going to say Henry for now. His... his uh, it sounds right. Henry sounds right. Uh, he's, like... I, I get it mixed up because uh, Barbosa's name is Hector, and um, Jack only ref <laughs> Jack for some reason only refers to Barbosa as Hector. Which when did that start? Uh, it's it actually started second movie I believe. Oh really? Second or third movie? Uh, no, third movie. Because I know you asked the same question when as we were watching it. Yeah. So I guess you found out at some point. Well, no, it's just because I thought about it and I was like, so in the first movie he he like does refer to him as Barbosa. The second movie, everybody thinks Barbosa is dead. It's at the end of the second movie when it's revealed that Barbosa is alive, but Jack is already in the locker. Um, eating peanuts. Eating a peanut. It's the same peanut. It's the same peanut. Oh, oh no! Wait, shit. Can I still consume them when they're frozen? Will they thaw out? Nope. Cool. <laughs> oh well. Um, it's just the same peanut. But yeah, so that's when the whole like calling him Hector starts. But like, so if I'm it, he introduces himself to Henry, and Henry is like, oh, uh, what's your name? Or he's like, he's talking to Henry, and he's like, hey, Henry, go um, go tell Sparrow to get rid of the compass, because for some reason that's the only way to unleash me from the Devil's Triangle. And then it turns out that like it's because um, 
It's because if you betray the compass, it'll release your worst fear, and every pirate's afraid of Salazar, I guess. Which I. Except, what if it just releases a bunch of spiders? What if, but, like, the thing is. Oh, shit. It shouldn't have released him for Jack because, like, the. Jack fucking Tokyo drifted a boat on him. Oh, yeah, I would not be afraid. Oh, we're. We, I think we've already fucked up. How? Hang on, let me check. Gather, gather that thing? Have we already fucked up? Oh, we haven't. Good. Yeah, so I grabbed keep, the first one. So. Keep an eye on those passing by through the top and bottom. I have. Okay. But, like, I, it, it just strikes me that Jack isn't afraid of that guy. Or he, I guess it could be a thing that, like, as he got older, he learned to fear him. Maybe, but also Jack, like, thought Salazar was dead. Like, he didn't even know that Salazar was a zombie thing. He just straight up thought that Salazar was dead. Well, I mean, isn't it that, like, I don't know. I don't know. I thought I he know, only. Man, but... I thought he only came back because of the curse. He was dead, and then the curse brought him back. Yeah, like he died in the Devil's Triangle, and then like that, um, that cursed him, and turned him into the zombie. And then the compass released because he was trapped in the Devil's Triangle uh, as a zombie. Uh, get it, get it, get it. Like he was trapped in the triangle as a zombie, which weird that it's the Devil's Triangle and not the Bermuda Triangle. But I whatever. I, that kept fucking me up. I kept thinking they were talking about like the Bermuda Triangle or something. I'm still waiting for you to get to the part where, like, Barbosa did that weird thing at the end where he's like, I care about you, my daughter, that only exists in this movie. <laughs> oh, yeah, but that was the... That was, that was another... Th the point that I was trying to make was that Salazar, when he introduces Milk. himself to Henry, he, he's like, can you give... Can you give Jack Sparrow a message from Captain Salazar? And then he pauses for a second and goes, Salazar. Because <laughs> <laughs> he literally... He goes, tell him. Just tell him from Captain Salazar. Salazar. <laughs> like, so it just seems like they, they fucked up and had to record the line twice, but they also just forgot to edit it out or something. Which, like, is absolutely ridiculous. Um, tell him Salazar is that Salazar. <laughs> <laughs> it's also really weird that, like, uh, Salazar's got, like, all the... His hair is meant to look like he's constantly underwater because he died drowning or some shit. It doesn't work because the CGI in that movie is just god awful. Yeah, so it, like every time he turns his head, his hair just like covers his face, and it looks really weird. I was really waiting for a scene where he like whips his head around, and he's like, <laughs> <laughs> he's like, because eh, 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 mm, eh, mm. it's like, because eh. it's like uh, in the Pirates of the Caribbean series, they oh shit, they don't care if you're a villain; they'll make you look stupid. Oh, they absolutely will. <laughs> 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 that got you. I don't know why. It's just the idea that like right. he would whip his own hair into his face <laughs> <laughs> and just start spitting it out. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So for this, we really just got to jump from boat to boat. Uh, it's pretty calm now, but it gets it gets hard. It gets okay, hard. man. Jeez. <laughs> don't worry about it. I just stabbed him. Yeah, man. And I threw a buzz saw at him. We are not the same. <laughs> Apparently not. My phone just vibrated under my butt. How'd that feel? Interesting. Learned something new about myself. What, and that something new is? I don't know. I don't like it. <laughs> what are uh, the implications? <laughs> <laughs> what does this mean for me? <laughs> it's like finding a double rainbow. Um, but yeah, like at the end of the movie, uh, Barbosa wants to like sacrifice himself for his daughter, and it's like kind of just ridiculous because um, I don't. How did? Crap, how did she find out that, like, that's her dad? Uh, did, uh did, did, wasn't it, like, the gem that she put in her, like, stupid-ass book? It was something like, like, he no, had... Cody! Oh, Cody, no. please! Lonnie! Lonnie! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, you're good. <laughs> I, think it, I think it was literally just... Oh, yeah. Uh, wee! Got it. Um, it was... I think it was literally just, like, he held onto her notebook, which, like... Oh, wait, no! No, 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 I, I don't no. think I can go back. Oh, I can. Oh, fuck. You got it. Good job. You're good. You're fine. It's, it's okay. I got it. Don't it's worry, okay. sweetie. <laughs> it's okay, sweetie. I'm alive. Oh. Good job. I know. Um, oh, God, fuck. But yeah, I think it was literally just a thing of, like... This stupid-ass book with the stupid-ass oh, gem fuck. that, like... Uh, I don't know, he had the other piece to or something? No, he, he kept her notebook after she, like, tried to throw it away or some shit. And then he was, like... I'm your dad, Arg. <laughs> I'm your dad, Arg. <laughs> a, uh, a an amazing quote, if ever there were one. Um, I, I, I'm never gonna forget how emotional that scene was, wherein Barbosa <laughs> reveals 
he is this woman's mother or father. <laughs> <laughs> I would go back. I'm like the mother. <laughs> and and I, I think it's really just powerful the arg at the end. Really, really just reaffirming that he is indeed a pirate. Um, proving that her lineage. Is <laughs> Dude. I hurt. <laughs> Dude, my muscles hurt. I changed my oil and I was basically just doing sit-ups the whole time. Isn't that just how it is to change your oil, though? Yeah. Okay, we gotta fight DVD. <laughs> your dad hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Kiss that's me, you dumb, fool. That's the dumbest joke ever, by the way. <laughs> I, I don't think anyone has ever made a joke dumber than that. <laughs> but, like, he, he, she sees that he has his notebook. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> like he, he, she sees that like he has the notebook, and she's like, "What am I to you?" And he goes, "Treasure," and then just falls. <laughs> it's like, "Are you okay? Do you need to take a breather? Do we need to pause for a minute?" Oh no, he looks ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> do we need to like? Do we need to pause <gasps> no, for I'm a good. minute? I'm are, good. Are you sure? I don't think you are. <laughs> I'm your dad. Um, are. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you're okay. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. No, I'm good, I'm good. Oh my god, my face hurts. <laughs> Dude. <coughs> Dude, I don't think you're okay. I think you uh I, I think you're uh <coughs> Do you need to take a breather? No. Are you sure? You're um I'm fine. I have I got I've <laughs> I've got myself together. I think you need to uh I think you need to take a breather, dude. No, no, I'm just imagining Barbosa as a mother. <laughs> <laughs> I be oh, your mommy. <laughs> I be your mommy. <laughs> you okay, dude? No. Ugh. Oh, shit. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Um, But, like, so... It's so stupid because he's like... She's like, what am I to you? And he just goes, treasure. And then he, and then he <laughs> and then does he throws it. Himself, he throws himself at Sal Salazar. <laughs> treasure. Treasure I don't want. And then he just jumps <laughs> up. Kills himself. <laughs> but like, really bad treasure. Like fool's gold or something. Like the, like the toy or, you get to the Fortnite. bottom of the cereal box. <laughs> or Fortnite V-Box. Ah, Worth nothing to me, but maybe to a child. <laughs> That's all you are to me. Something to sell to a child. Just get, like, weirdly... <laughs> just get really weird about it. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Oh, my God. We are both in pain from laughing. It was my so joke. Stupid. It was my fault we're in pain. <laughs> I know. It was a really stupid joke, too. You did a good job. Ugh. Okay, we got him. Oh, man, okay. Oh, my God, dude. I am your dad. Arg. <laughs> <laughs> then he just falls. <laughs> oh god, dude, it's so stupid. That movie is just like not fun to watch. There was that part where like the girl saw like what dead people and she was like the ah! she ran oh, yeah. into the forest. <laughs> that was probably like the best scene in the movie. Well, that and the dead the dead sharks cuz that's just f fucking hilarious to joke. About. Oh, we missed one. We missed Oh, that was pretty good. That was pretty good though. Well, like, that was probably the best scene in the movie, is both when he, like, just tosses the sharks in, and then we joked about, like, he just does it, like, <laughs> in the hopes that they'll attract regular sharks. <laughs> and then when she sees fucking the dead pirates and just screams and runs away. Oh my, a floor way. The real Chloraline asks Kirby to help her save Leongar. The phantom feline is a fake, formed from negative thoughts and a powerful psychic energy. This wild beast doesn't seem to care about Leongar at all. She may be an illusion, but her claws will cause real damage. Yeah, we know about that, Cody. <laughs> I got stabbed 37 times. It was fun. Uh, uh. But we gotta... Oh my god, I'm your dad, Art. <laughs> <laughs> that's... Oh my god, that's so stupid. <laughs> Alright, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> you okay? You're, sh you're laughing so hard you're shaking the bed. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, are you alright? No, because I'm just imagining that movie where he actually just says that. He's just, just I'm your dad. <laughs> and then he jumps into, into the bad guy. <laughs> oh my god, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Kirby in the Forgotten Lands. Jesus Christ. We should do movie reviews. Oh 
We should just watch movies on Tubi and then, like, do reviews about them. If we do movie reviews, I'll have to figure out the, like, copyright way, the copyright thing about it. Just flip it. Damn, man, do you, you got think, me. Do you think that the people who make movies on Tubi actually have the money to, to take you to court? Oh, well, I mean, they'd earn a lot of money if they did. That's true. But, like, Cody, we got the other I movie. know, I know. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Kirby and the Forgotten Lands. We hope you enjoy it. We'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>